Scorpio, in this message, you and your person are having to sneak around. There's somebody here that you're having to hide this connection from, and it's causing some disruptions. Also, not being honest about how you feel in the present energy with one another. Let's dive in and see where this is all headed. Hello, everyone, and welcome in. Hope everyone is doing well. Positive healing vibes to all the subscribers, the viewers, and the world out there. Today, we're looking into Scorpios inside of their mind reading for the month of March. In this message, Scorpio, we're going to tap into the energy surrounding you, the energy surrounding your person, and we're going to see what's challenging this. Then we're going to dive a little bit deeper into your person's energy. And in this portion of the message, we'll look at what their perception of you is, what their perception of the challenge is, what they're not telling you in the present energy their true intentions are moving forward. I'm going to clarify throughout the message. I'll pull a few cards at the end for advice guidance moving forward. If it's something you're interested in, you're more than welcome in joining us. Also, guys, if you like the vibe, how I interpret the cards, you're more than welcome to subscribe to the channel. Everyone's welcome, and it does help to set intentions for future messages. So let's dive in and see what we can see for your upcoming energy for the month of March. Scorpio, I want to start by saying you and this person have intense feelings for one another, but are not expressing your emotions in the present energy. I feel like how you guys feel about one another is hidden. I do feel here, Scorpio, that you guys are both kind of waiting, analyzing the situation for one another. Okay, how each of you are perceiving one another. Your energy, Scorpio, is the Hierophant, the High Priestess, the Knight of Cups. The High Priestess, this is the hidden energy, okay? This is the hidden energy. I feel here, Scorpio, you do see, you can envision this person in your future. But I feel in the present energy, you haven't exactly come forward and expressed this to this person now. Let's clarify this energy here. Your person is coming out as the four of pentacles, the strength with the temperance energy. So I feel like this person is withdrawn. I feel like they're focused on their foundation. They're focused on their future. It's almost an energy of healing, trying to have patience with the process and focus on their foundation. Okay. Patience. The challenge here, Scorpio, the Two of Wands, the King of Wands, the Page of Pentacles. I feel like there's outside interference. For some of you, this may actually be a father figure, more so than a romantic partnership, uh, but it doesn't necessarily have to be. This father figure is a big determining factor in your person's life. I feel like they probably look up to their dad. They probably have a very close connection with that person. So let's clarify the Hierophant, the High Priestess, the Knight of Cups for Scorpio's energy. I feel here, Scorpio, you may express emotions to this person, but I don't feel like you truly tell this person how you feel. I honestly feel Scorpio like you envision a future with this person you envision a long-term commitment with this person for a lot of you you couldn't envision your future without this person 
And the reason why I say this, Scorpio, is because we have the King of Swords on the bottom of the deck. You feel like this is your counterpart. Like, this is somebody who you couldn't envision living without. Clarify this Four of Pentacles, the Strength, Temperance, Energy for Scorpio's person. I feel like this person is really focused on work really focused on their balance. I feel here, Scorpio, at this time, they're not really open to anything coming into their life romantically. And even though they may feel a connection here with you, I do feel like they are holding back. Let's clarify the Two of Wands, the King of Wands with the Page of Pentacles. So... Scorpio, I feel here there is going to be a conversation, okay? There's going to be a conversation that's going to be had about how you guys feel about one another. Now, I do feel an energy of maybe having to sneak, go behind someone's back. And that's why I feel like this is channeling a father figure. I feel like you and this person most likely are going to have to maybe sneak around for a little bit, not be so open about your relationship. But I do feel here there is going to be a conversation. You guys are going to have a conversation about how you guys truly feel. So let's dive a little bit deeper into this person's energy here, Scorpio. All positive. I don't feel like that Seven of Swords they're clarifying is anything negative. I feel like this is part of the challenge. So this is part of you and this person's challenges. There is a person that is interfering with this connection coming together. And you guys are trying to find a way around this. Scorpio's person's true intentions. In the present energy. Now, for some of you, this could be this could be a person that they're seeing or interested in. But I honestly feel here, Scorpio, the energy that your person is coming out with is the energy of not really focused on relationships, but more so focused on work, focused on their process, and focused on healing. Freeing themselves from something that was holding them back or is currently holding them back. Their perception of you, Scorpio, is reciprocated. I feel here they look at you as their counterpart, first of all. They do see a future here with you, but I do feel like there is some things that they see you freeing yourself from in order to come forward to meet them halfway. For some of you, this person is being a little bit strategic with how they proceed because of whatever person they're trying to hide something from. I do feel there is somebody here that's influencing this decision here. The King of Wands, the Page of Pentacles, could be a fire sign, could be an earth sign. So Scorpio, their perception of the challenge, I feel like this makes them very distraught, very unhappy. I also feel like this is causing a lot of disruptions for them. Okay, and it's almost as if this person is trying to control the situation. That's where that strategic part comes in. Okay, honestly, it would probably just be best if you guys just came out with it. Came out with the secret, whatever you're hiding or whoever you're hiding it from. It's best just to be honest. Now, for whatever reason, this information is being withheld. Your person is trying to control the situation. They probably are very anxious, very nervous at certain times. And this probably causes a lot of complications between the two of you when you guys are together. And I do feel, Scorpio, that's most likely why you're not coming forward and expressing how you feel to this person completely. So what are they not telling Scorpio in the present energy? Please and thank you, Spirit. What is this person not saying here? I 
feel like this person is is getting anxious. They're gonna they're about to come forward. They're about to come out with this information. I feel like they want to say that you guys are together. They want to come out with this. They're tired of guarding the secret. Now, for some of you, that you may not want them to come out with this information quite yet. Again, there's that strategic part. The Page of Pentacles is definitely being strategic, having a strategy, seeking more information, looking into something before just taking action. The Knight of Swords, on the other hand, is a, a very impulsive energy, okay? I feel like this person is getting ready to just say, just say what they want to say. Just tell the world that you guys are together. I feel here, Scorpio, there is an energy of not being able to hold this in. That could be why there's this distance between the two of you. So... What is this person's true intentions moving forward here for Scorpio in the present energy? Please and thank you, Spirit. What is this person's true intentions moving forward? Mm. Scorpio. I feel like this person is going to be impulsive. There is a need to be mindful of this energy. Try to keep the peace. Keep the peace, I keep hearing. Keep the peace. This person is about to come out with this secret. They're about to just say whatever is on their mind or how they feel. I do feel like this is going to cause some disruptions now. This tower moment, it you can minimize this damage, okay, by not just being so impulsive with what you say or how you say it. Maybe there is a need to kind of have a conversation with your person. If you guys are in, in an energy of talking, having a conversation about what your next move should be together, or how you guys should move forward, because I do feel like your person is is kind of an energy of enough is enough. They don't want to hold this back any longer. So, Scorpio, let's pull a few cards out here for your advice guidance moving forward. I am going to do an extended version to the reading, guys. Thank you guys so much for all the love and support. If you find the message helpful, resonating with your situation, please give it a thumbs up. The extended version, we're going to look into the hidden energies a little bit deeper. We'll see where this is all headed. The outcome if the advice is followed. It's all going down in the extended version and the links are all below. Two of Wands, Strength, Eight of Wands. So there is a need here to be strategic. Two of Wands. Take some time before you take action. There may need to be a conversation again, guys, with your person. Talk it out. Plan this out because if this is like a father figure that maybe could cut this person off from inheritance, something along those lines, that's going to be something that you're going to need to be mindful of, okay? Maybe it's not that serious and maybe this is just your person not wanting to upset their dad. Maybe it is something that can just be said, but coming together, being on the same page and having a better understanding of how you should proceed with one another is what's going to be important here, especially because you guys are supposed to be on the same team being in a relationship. Pull a romance angel card out here. Sum up your reading, Scorpio. I do feel here there is an energy of out with it, okay? The secret isn't going to be able to be kept very much longer. I will say that, okay? And this is very interesting. Healing family issues. Your love life benefits as you forgive your parents. 
beautiful 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 so scorpio i feel like that's a good solid message coming out thank you guys so much for all the love and support thank you for liking subscribing sharing the content you guys are all amazing again if you want to get in on the extended version the links are all below otherwise thank you guys again and i look forward to seeing your beautiful souls again soon namaste